and today the topic of discussion is max and min heap so prior to you know heap sort we should have a proper understanding of what is max heap and min heap so let's start with max heap and min heap so what is max heap and min heap so prior to this i'll explain you a complete binary tree i'll explain you complete binary tree complete binary tree what is heap heap is actually a complete binary tree so what is complete binary tree a complete binary tree is a tree which of something like this a first node come here then second left then then right then we start filling the second child first then this then this then this and then this then this node this node is this a complete binary tree no because first the left cho left child of this node should come so if this is not left child then it will not is this a complete binary tree yes this is a complete binary tree is a complete binary tree yes this is a complete binary is this a complete binary tree no so the numbering start from you know 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 so number start from uh, number start uh, from 1 from left to right from left to right no we have to keep this particular mind so if this is a heap then it has to follow it has to follow complete binary tree property so let's see what is max heap and min heap so what is min heap when every node any node when any node, if you tick pick pick any node and it's lesser than it's both the child no if you see 10 10 is less than it's both the child then this is what min heap if you pick 30 30 is less than it's both the child fine if you pick 15 15 is less than it's both the child then this is called min heap this is called min heap and make it sure it's not bst no left should be less than or right it's not bst it's simply a min heap then what is max heap? just opposite of min heap what is um, uh, how to uh, you know uh, analyze this if this is 100 then it should be greater than it's both the child yes it's greater if i pick this node then it should be greater than it's both the child yes it's greater if i pick this node then it should be greater than it's both the child yes so this is max heap and min heap the top element of min heap the top element of min heap is the smallest among the tree the top element of max heap is the largest among the entire tree and we have used we have used min and max heap for priority queue no if you have seen the video of priority queue so in priority queue, in order to implement priority queue we have used min heap and man, max heap fine so this is what min heap and man, max heap is all about now comes the question is that you have to create a max heap using the following element so you have to create the element using uh, uh, you have to create the max heap using following element so first of all what i'll say these are what suppose these are array you no know, array of elements so uh, let me make an array and put all this element in an array so 6 14 3 26 8 18 21 9 and 5 fine okay so this is index i'll start from index 1 3 4 5 6 7 eight and nine so there are ten elements now now i have to make a max heap so is this a max heap no so how the tree will be created six will come here then the next element will come 14 here then three will be here first make a complete binary tree fine okay then 26 then what comes then eight then 18 then comes uh 21 then comes nine and then comes five fine okay so these are what these are this is a complete binary tree. now is this a max heap no because this element is not greater than it's both the child so what you do simply you just count the number of elements so how many elements you have so if you see the number of elements you have nine elements from one to nine you have nine elements so what do you have you have total nine elements so number of elements is what number of elements is equal to 9 so from where you will start you will start from floor of 9 by 2 so what is 9 by 2 4.5 and the floor value is 4 you will start from 4 so this is the first index this is the second index this is the third this is the fourth this one is the fifth sixth seventh eighth and nine so you will start from four and you will back to one so you will start from four then four then three then two then one so so suppose the current value of i is this now among all the three elements that is the node itself and both the child which one is maximum since this is maximum so what i'll do i'll not interchange it i'll keep it like this no this is a comp this is a max heap now what i'll do i'll in decrement i i will from four it will become three so i will come here now i among all these three elements i'll compare which one is the maximum the maximum is 21 so what i'll do i'll i'll, I'll interchange maximum and i so what will happen 26 will come here 26 will come here and 3 will come here 
26 and what was that uh, 3 yeah 3 will come here fine okay now what will happen so after this what will happen you know after this uh, though the max will become i after this the max will become i since there is no node so nothing will take place so now i will become 2 so i will come here now i'll explain you what am i trying to tell you i will become so among these three elements which is maximum this is maximum so i'll interchange so what will happen 26 will come here and 14 will come here now due to this 14 is my property is uh, violated so again this max will become i and i'll compare which is maximum this is maximum so nothing will happen fine okay now i explain you what i'm trying to tell you again so now i will become one so i will come here fine okay so among these three which one is maximum so this is 26 and this one is i think this should be 26 26 this should be 21 if i'm not wrong 26 3 and uh, this should be 21 I, I suppose this should be 21 fine okay this should be 21 fine okay now comes uh, now comes the question now, among these which one is maximum this one is maximum so what will happen 26 will come up and 6 will come down fine okay now due to this 6 while we have you no know, brought this 6 down due to this is this property is in uh, max heap property no this is not max heap property because this is not greater than it's both the child so this max will become i and now i'll compare uh, these three element which one is maximum this one is maximum what will happen 6 will come down and 14 will come up fine so again due to this 6 is my max heap property violated yes so what will happen this i will max will become i and i'll compare which one is maximum this one is maximum so what will happen 9 will come here and 3 will come here fine uh, 3 whatever it was uh, 6 or whatever it was it will come here fine it was 6 6 will come here fine okay so what happened so now this this if you see this tree now if i, I change the color if you see this tree so this tree is what max heap this tree is what max heap why max heap because if you consider any node it's greater than it's both the child this node greater than both the child this node greater than both the child this node greater than both the child yes this is a max heap so this is a heap which is used for which is used for finding heap sort no for calculating sorting for sorting for sorting what heap sort so first of all you should have a proper understanding of max heap and min heap similarly you can create min heap also first of all you create a complete binary tree and you know you just compare it the ch from among all the three child three nodes that is from parent left child and right child which one is minimum keep it on the upside fine so this is how you can keep create min heap also so this is the procedure where i have created max heap now you have to again uh, no you have to again update the array so if i'll update the array now what will happen so since we have taken this element let me since we have taken this element this element now this element has converted to this element so what will happen 26 will come here then 14 then 21 then we have 9, 8, 18, 9, 8, 18, 3, then we have uh, 6 and 5, fine. So this is what, this array is now max heap. This array is now max heap. And this was raw array. This was raw array. This was raw array, now this is max heap, fine, okay. So uh, let me start again, okay. So with the question, now you have a question in front of you that given an array, number of nodes construct max heap from the values what will be the pre-order first of all you have to construct max heap and then from max heap you have to construct pre-order so what will happen now let me make a first tree 5 13 2 25 7 we have 17 we have 20 we have 8 then we have 4 so let me index the tree so if i'll index this tree what will happen this is at first first index this is at second index third index fourth index fifth index sixth index seventh index eighth index and ninth index so again how to make how to make a max heap you will start from length by 2 what is length 9 so 9 by 2 is what 4 so i'll start from 4 so i'll start from 4 here so among these elements which one is maximum 25 is maximum do i need to exchange anything no everything is fine what will happen i will come here fine i will come here which one is maximum this one is maximum so what this 2 and 20 will get a uh, change so what will happen 20 will come up so what will happen actually 20 will come up and 2 will come down fine okay 2 will come down okay so now what will what is happen uh there is nothing after this max i'll not do anything again i'll move to 
uh, I will move to second position. So what well, among these three elements, which one is maximum? This one is maximum. What I'll do? I'll interchange. So what will happen? 13 will come down and 25 will come up. So 13 will come down. Due to this 13, my tree property is breaking. My maxi property is uh, violating. No, there is no violation. I'll not do anything. Fine. Okay. Now what will happen? I will come to the first position. That is from 4, 3, 2 and now 1. Again, I'll cons consider which one is maximum. This one is maximum. I'll interchange it. What will happen? 5 will come here. 25 will come here. Fine. Okay. Due to this 5, is my maxi property violated? Yes. Because 5 is smaller than 13. What will happen? Among these three elements, which one is maximum? This one is maximum. So, it will get interchange. 13 will come here. 5 will come here. Due to this 5, what happened? Now, this will become I. Is my property broken? Yes. Viol well, uh, violated? Yes. What will happen? This is max. And what will happen? 8 will come up and 5 will come down. Now, we have completed. Now, this current this current arrangement is what maxi so what is maxi uh, 25 25 13 20 uh, then we have 8 then we have 7 17 then we have 2 then we have 5 and then we have 4 now what happens now see what happens now what now what now what what you have to do is again you have to find the pre-order your 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 answer is not this you want to find the pre-order this is maxi this is maxi this is maxi but you have to find pre-order of maxi so what is pre-order i told you just make a line no what is pre-order the left left line in every node just make a line no i've already explained you in binary tree how to calculate order so you start from here so first is 25 which is touching then 13 which is touching then 8 then 5 then i'll move inside and then when i come out 5 and 4 then 8 then 5 then 4 I'll again move inside and when I'll come out, this 7 will touch, 7, again I'll move inside and when I'll come out, 20, first 20 will touch, no, let me make it, now 17 is not touching first, I'll go inside and when I'll come back, so first 20 will touch, then 17, the moment I'll come out, the 17 will get touched, then we'll move inside, then 2 will touch, fine and again I'll move there so finally this is the result 25 13 8 5 4 25 13 8 5 4 7 and so c is the correct answer so yes c is the correct answer and hope you know how to calculate pre-order and post-order of a trade fine so my job is not to explain you what is pre-order and post-order i just explain you what how to do to do this uh property